Kevin Hanna here with D-League alum Trey Kelly played for the Sioux Falls Sky Force this past year along with the Austin Toros. Now Trey coming off a good win here tonight, 87-75 against the Denver Nuggets. We were talking with Connor Henry after the game. He said you guys did a really good job defensively guarding the pick and roll. Uh, talk about that from a player's perspective, what you guys were able to do defensively. Well, obviously some adjustments we made from last game. Um, we didn't go to pick and roll very well, especially with the kids. And uh, we just wanted to make some adjustments with the best of film. And, you know, once you do that stuff, you get better. You know, that's what the professionals do. And, you know, we looked over some things that we need to correct, and we did that. And we came out tonight, and we, uh, we adjusted and we applied that to the court. Now, kind of the calling card of D-League Select here at Summer League is that they have a little more to prove the players on this team. has a little more to prove than, than other other players on other teams. Do you kind of feel that vibe with this team as well? Of course, you know, playing in the D-League, you know, you know, some of these guys are play against, the guys are making $2 million, and, you know, they're living the life, man, they're enjoying it. They're really happy with you. Know, I saw one. one you know, that's motivating. It's motivating. You know, you know, you know, especially a guy like myself, I've been playing professionally. You know, this is my eighth year coming out. You know, when the start of the season comes, and you know, I see these guys on TV. You know, I think I can play in the league. I get a lot of feedback from NBA teams and people that I know in the NBA that say you know, they think I should be there, that I belong. And, uh, you know, that's motivation for me to come out and try to prove myself against these guys. And I know I speak for the other guys as well. Yeah, and anybody who's watched you, seen the way you run the team, the way you're able to shoot and shoot the basketball, that you are worthy of an NBA call. Do, do you think there's one facet of your game, though, that you need to work on to, to take that final step? Um, something I've done here so, um, since we've started in the summer, they just played pretty good defense. I've stayed in front of my man. And uh, maybe that was a question before. And, uh, you know, I worked on the body, got a little quicker, and I tried to improve some things you know, like defensively. And, and it's working. You know, I'm standing in front of these guys, you know, guys with NBA contracts. And, you know, that's intriguing to me. And I just want to keep working, man, on even my strengths. You know, if I'm, if I'm doing something well, I, mean, I want to do it even better. You know, I'm not playing perfect games here, but I know I am playing real, but I still want to do it. Uh, you mentioned you're coming up on your eighth year professionally uh, playing pro ball. Do you feel like that's a deterrent to, to GMs that you aren't? You know, 22 years old anymore? Oh, I could be, but I think um, it may intrigue them that I'm still, still looking at them. You know, I think I'm still quick and still fast, probably even quicker and faster. But like I said, I work on my body and got a little slimmer. I got, I'm, I'm able to move around a little bit quicker and faster. I, feel. Um, but I don't know what they think. You know, I don't know what they think about my age, but that doesn't bother me. Um, I'm still determined. So motivated to every day to go in and try to do my job. And that's why I came. Even when I'm at home training, I mean, I train every single day. Push myself and try to just, you know, get you a my goal, which is the NBA. I want to accomplish that no matter what. And lastly, Trey, you know, talking about your time here in the D League, playing for D League Select. How has playing in the D League helped you as a pro? I think it's helped me a lot, man, tremendously. Um, like you said, you talked about me running the team. That's something that I've learned in the D League. You know, when you go overseas, you, know, you look for different stuff from the point guard. You know, not always running the team. You know, once you score a little bit, I play in China. You know, I had you know 50 points in, in two in two games over the you know average almost 30, and uh, you know uh, when I went to Sioux Falls, I was able to uh, take on a leadership role. You know, I had young guys, and I was able to lead those guys. You know, Sean Brooks and Coach Pat Durant, they pushed me and uh, you know asked me to lead those guys when I came, and that's what I did. It helped my leadership. It helped me understand the game more, especially at the uh, NBA pro level. And um, it's been helping me a lot, man. And I really thank everybody in the league that gave me a shot. It gave me an opportunity to go out there and help myself and try to develop everything that I need to develop and make it to the league. Trey Kelly, coming to an NBA arena near you. Thanks for your time, Trey.